virtual function and virtual base classes in C++. How can we implement virtual function and virtual base classes with the help of a program in C++ programming language? Hello everyone, I'm Sukanya from GoEduHub Technologies and in this video we are going to discuss about virtual function and virtual base classes in C++. Virtual function in C++ is a member function of base class which is redefined in child class. So this function is again defined in the child class of a base class and this is actually a member function. Now there are several rules to implement virtual functions. Those are virtual functions is declared using virtual keyword. Virtual functions must be a member of some other class. Virtual functions cannot be static in nature. It can be the friend function of other classes, friend function which we previously discussed in our videos. It is assessed through the object pointers. Object pointers are used to assess the virtual function. A virtual functions must be defined in base class even if it is not used. Even if you are not using it, then also it has to be defined in the base class. Now here is an example you can see of virtual function. And here you can see that the virtual keyword is used with the function void display. And that is for the base class. That is inside the base class. And next is redeclaration of that child class is done. That is void display. It is redeclared, redefined again for the function. What is going to print is child class. And then you are passing, creating the pointer of the base class. That is uh, asterisk sign P. And that is passing the value, creating a pointer. And that's how you can display it with this particular function. And this is P dot display function. So the output will be base class and child class. For programming, you can refer to the tutorial. Pure virtual function which does not perform any task in the base class but it is only declared inside the base class. It is not performing anything but it is just likely to be declared inside the base class. When the function has no definition, such function is also known as do nothing function. Another name for pure virtual function and any other function which has no definition is known as do nothing function. Now here you can see that this is a do nothing function doing over here virtual display. This is the virtual function again being discussed and the output is only child class. Why? Because it is a do nothing function. The definition of function is not actually there. That's why it is a pure virtual function. Class containing the pure virtual function cannot be used to declare the objects of its own as classes are known as abstract classes. So no objects can be declared. Next thing is what is a virtual class? Now virtual class is used to virtual inheritance for implementing that and to prevent multiple inheritance in inheritance hierarchy so that multiple inheritance is not actually done. Now why virtual function? Consider a base class A which has two other child classes B and C inherited. From classes B and C, D is further inheritance. Now to prevent this all ambiguity, a virtual class is used so that ambiguity can be reduced. The syntax here is class, then we have to mention the child class name, along with that public, virtual keyword is used and then the base class. Then the class body, whatever concepts of programming you are using. Similarly, the class, the child class and then the public base class you can also mention with the help of public keyword. Such as in this program you can see that public is used along with virtual base classes so to avoid the ambiguity of two base classes in a particular parent class. So this is how it can be done and output will again display the value which we have mentioned in the cout function. So to remove the ambiguity in inheritance of multiple inheritance cases we use virtual class. For the programs and the examples you can refer to the tutorial. For more upcoming programs and the concepts of object oriented programming we will look into upcoming videos. Thank you.